Hi, I'm Kim Carter. I'm in a research field called bioinformatics, which is an exciting new field which tries to answer research questions using computers. It's come about in the last 20 or so years as a result of our amazing advances in computer technology and, and biotechnologies. And we're really at the point now where, where it's a little bit too much for, for one single person or one lab group to be able to take in all of the data that's available to them to help them answer a particular question. So we need computers to do that, to help us do that. And so I'm one of the people that helps steer the computer in the right direction to help us answer our research questions. Hi, I'm Richard Francis. I work in the field of bioinformatics, which is essentially the application of computer science to answer biological questions. Science has changed quite considerably over the last 20 years. Uh, major um, influences have been the advances in technology um, and their application to, to science. Uh, when I was at school, I used to go in and do one experiment and get one result. Whereas these days, scientists are, are doing one experiment and generating millions and millions of results. And this is where bioinformatics comes in. Um, as the name would suggest, we, uh, it's the application of computer science to, uh, to biology. Uh, we write software and uh, use other people's software and work really closely with the Institute's biostatistics teams to take those millions and millions of data points and narrow them down to a handful of interesting data points that the researchers can then use to decide their next course of action. Um, really, with uh, modern day science, the overwhelming volumes of data that um, scientists have to generate to stay at the cutting edge of research means that science just really can't do without the influence of uh, bioinformatics and biostatistics. It's really satisfying when even just those, those little findings or those little results where you've, you've helped somebody out and it's enabled them to do something that they, they couldn't possibly do before, that you've, you know, that's, that's that kind of little satisfying moment I get and you know the, the ultimate picture is you know let's let's hope that our work um, does make an enormous impact in people's lives through you know identifying new therapies or by bringing together lots of different data sets suddenly it allows some pattern to emerge um, that people couldn't see before because they couldn't they just couldn't physically put all the data together so that's that's kind of the ultimate goal and that's the that's the big win in bioinformatics that we're always looking for.